My Patty, I have been dreaming of this day for so long. From our Southridge Lake summer pool dates up until this morning, when I woke up knowing this is the day you will make me the happiest woman on earth. I have prayed for this day and I am overwhelmed with joy that it is here. We have walked through so many stages of life together, but I know that embarking on this next chapter with you as Mr. and Mrs. Humes will be my absolute favorite of them all. You have everything I could want for my partner in life. You are wildly intelligent, a little, okay, maybe a lot, quirky, and more handsome by the day. Your confidence and willingness to be open with your feelings is something I very much admire about you. But more than all of those things, I know your love and support for me is unwavering. And same goes of mine to you. You're my confidant and give me a comfort that I can't put into words. I have loved you since I was 18 years old and I vow to love you every single day for my whole entire life. On the great days, on the tough ones, and everything in between, I will love you, take care of you, and be faithful to you. You are the half that makes me whole and you make my smile shine brighter each day. I love you, Patty, and I'm so unbelievably excited to become your wife today. With abundant love, your wife, Ashley. Ashley, it's weird to think that we were just 18 when we first got together. We were just kids, and if you would have told me that the girl that sat on my lap at that Cinco de Mayo party would one day become my wife, I wouldn't have believed it. We've grown up a lot since then. I no longer wear toe shoes and I, make and I take Metamucil every day. Really though, we both have made a life in Dallas together and began some pretty good careers. It goes to show that life changes quickly and often as we get older. Ever thought that we're probably closer in time to having kids than we are to when we graduated college? It's sort of scary. Life will keep moving forward, whether we're ready for it or not. I think this is why people get married, because people need a partner to handle the various challenges that life brings about. It's what makes life worth living, knowing that you get to face uncertainty with a partner. Knowing this, I vow to always grow into the man you deserve at the different stages of your life. Wherever life takes us, whatever brings about the good and the bad, I make the commitment to you today that I will always be there to love, support, and advise you. I'm an incredibly lucky guy and I'm so excited for our future together. Today I marry my best friend, my confidant, and the woman I love with my entire body, soul, and spirit. This is my love song to you. Let every woman know Hi Patrick, you take you Ashley. To be my wife. Be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. Stop watching as you leave. I will never stop losing my breath. Every time I see you looking back at me, and I will never stop holding your hand. I will never stop opening your door. I will never stop choosing you, babe. I will never get used to you. I actually take you, Patrick, to be my husband, to be my husband, to have and to hold, to have and to hold, from this day forward, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to love and to cherish, until we are parted by death, until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. I will never stop trying. I will never stop watching as you leave I will never stop losing my breath Every time I see you looking back at me And I will never stop holding your hand I will never stop opening your door I will never stop choosing you, babe I will never get used to you So
stop trying I'll never stop watching as you leave I'll never stop losing my breath Every time I see you looking back at me And I will never stop holding your hand I will never stop opening your door I will never stop choosing you, babe I will never get used to you Ashley, I give you this ring as a sign of my vow, as a sign of my vow, and with all that I am, and with all that I am, and all that I have, and all that I have, I honor you. I honor you. Pat, I give you this ring. Pat, I give you this ring as a sign of my vow, as a sign of my vow, and with all that I am, and with all that I am, and all that I have, and all that I have, I honor you. I honor you. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Bear witness to the love of God in this world so that those to whom love is a stranger will find in you the most generous of friends. Okay? You may kiss your bride. I mean, I know y'all are eager. I mean, this is a great party we're waiting. Fif 15 years, most ruckus sort of reaction to a, hey, look at him. So well done, y'all. Not bad for an economist, either. Uh, but friends, it is with the greatest honor that I introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Patrick George Humes.
I, I view the world with what I call the the universal dad with daughters philosophy. Basically, I embrace cynicism and suspicion. That's kind of my role. What I did like about Patrick, though, is that he was tall. And you know, I didn't really know that this was going to be a lasting thing. So I figured that that, 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 that sort of worked in my favor. And so, those of you that know me, you know that um, I take a lot of pictures. I mean, I got like thousands of pictures, you know. And so, basically, the pictures that I have at home are Ashley, you know, she's her looking awesome. And even some with her friends, they're totally looking awesome, too. Yeah, yeah. And then them with like some guy's torso. <laughs> You know what I mean? And so, that's kind of how a lot of pictures looked early on. But, but after a while, you know, we realized how special Patrick was. And so I started raising the camera. <laughs>